you see in the blue color highlighted thing this is where you actually write your code somewhere you need to write it correctly but so the console.readline has a capital C console a period operator and R in caps read and L in caps read line and it also has a semicolon at the end now as you saw previously in the class code snippet the my class was actually highlighted so how do you do that feature is you need to go to declarations open the literal you need to go to ID ID is some kind of a placeholder so this is where I put like a text so this is actually what has to come over here now so if you want something inside the console.readline brackets which are actually in programming you wouldn't do that so what you do is two dollar signs in between the dollar signs you put the text now uh, it has to have a default value so you go to the default value this is my text this will be my default value for the thing and you can have a tooltip delete the text so a code snippet is done all you need to do is under this code snippet you need to have format which is 1.0.0 select the whole document using control A hit the K and F to align now save this file as a XML code snippet so how do you do that as go to file go to save XML file as under the drop down menu select the snippet change the file name as my snippet for forum code call I would save it under my desktop please do remember the shortcut key for right now my shortcut is console.readline now you can close this I would open the class now now you need to install the code snippet in order to use them this is how you install the code snippet go to the tools option go to the code snippets manager click the import tab go to the desktop way you save it go to the my snippets click on open all you need to do is a location where you, you need to install the code snippet it's actually the default is my code snippets click on finish now if you browse through your code snippet there's over here see there's a description shortcut as well as author which was read from the header tag and this is used by the add-ins manager so I click on OK now if I hit the CR key you would see the console.readline method it's a snippet adds console.readline method so I, I hit the tab tab key so I because I had a uh, multiple snippets which previously I had also done a snippet on console.readline so that's why it's popping me out about multiple snippets so I would select this one or this one both are the same so hit the tab key as you see it's coming like this is my text which we had written in the code snippet if you hover your mouse over the snippet you would have the tooltip which is delete the text so all you need to do is delete the text you're done thanks for watching my tutorial
subscribe to the YouTube channel of the Forum Core Call and try becoming a member. It's a lot more easier to become a member.